just talk about your recruiting process to come here in the portal. What was that process like for you and why did you ultimately settle on FSU being the place for you? Yeah, it was very hard. I mean, I, obviously there's great, great programs out there and I think I got to look at a bunch of them. I went to Duke, Florida State and was going to go to Notre Dame as well, but um, that didn't end up working out. So got to go to a lot of different programs, see a lot of, I also went to Virginia. Um, got to see a lot of different programs and for me it was just trying to find the best place for me and um, I looked into how people played and just everything about it and I think it ultimately came down to um, making sure I was going to fit in and Florida State was the best fit for me. Having a familiarity with the system that he operates with, how much did that play a role? Yeah, it definitely did. I mean, I watched games back and just asking myself how I'd fit in and I could just see myself fitting in with the creativity and everything that Florida State already had. What was last week like for you going on the road, hitting those two big goals, also having the big assist? Yeah, um, it was great. Everything about it was just so um, rewarding. I think we've been working so hard as a team and uh, just getting to see those two big wins against some top competition was was great. And I think uh, we're learning and grow growing as a team, but we're also um, where we want to be and uh, growing each day. So just getting to win and um, had a great ball from Ron to be able to finish and then Obviously, the drive from me, but uh, we had players making self selfless runs and just opening up that space for me to be able to shoot the goal. How good was was the passing to set up some of those goals? Because you guys didn't have a lot of time together in, in practice before this, this road trip. Yeah, preseason was really short for us. And um, I think just learning each other throughout the spring, we were, st we were still coming back. And I think a lot of us were on international duties and just getting to play with each other and learn about each other, it's only going to get better. And I'm excited um, to just continue growing with this team because you already see all the um, movement and the runs and they're already so creative. So I'm excited to um, continue to grow with them. Does it almost feel like preseason is between TCU and USF in the sense that the whole team's actually together for once? Yeah, it definitely does. I think uh, even from the UCF game until then, we were still trying to find, we had players coming back and we still have players coming back. So just getting back with everyone and going to continue to work on that is definitely going to be good. How important is this week going to be for you guys? You have the week off and then getting USF. How important is it going to be for you guys you know, coming back together and being a collective whole and not you know, worrying about a game coming up? Yeah, it's it's been great. I think after a hard two games in um, Texas, I, I think this is a great time to just rest, relax, but also we're going to work on some things that we need to get together. Um, as we did today, we worked on things that we want to improve on for the next games that we saw in Texas. So. Um, getting to do that within this week where we would normally be playing games, I think is uh, a great experience because we're working on them to improve for the next games that we can play. What were the biggest things that you took away from those games out of Texas? Yeah, I mean, I think each game presents different things that we get out of it. Um, I think we can take a look. I think we could do a little bit better. We have so much talent in the attack and just knowing that, um, I think we can create more opportunities. I think we were a little bit, not hesitant, I wouldn't say, but I think we can really press and create more opportunities and goals.